have you seen this woman? A mother of three from Staten Island disappears without a trace. Tonight, her family now desperate for answers. I News reporter Josh Einiger live in the Midland Beach section with our lead story tonight. Josh. Bill, she never turned up at a scheduled court hearing and divorce court against her soon-to-be ex-husband. She never arrived at her substitute teacher job not far from here, and she's AWOL at this Dollar Tree where she works the register. Janine Camerata is nowhere to be found, and tonight her friends are terrified. What happened to Janine Camerata, the substitute teacher, a mother of three? Really freaked out, really. A friend who's vanished, practically without a trace. Turn it off. I just, oh, so this is just not like her. Tonight at the Dollar Tree where Camerata worked a second job, detectives took her coworker and boyfriend in for questioning. Saturday night, he's the one who called 911 and said she was gone, last seen leaving his new Springville apartment to meet her estranged husband and see their kids. Oh. Elizabeth Torres works at the Dollar Tree. She let me know Friday that she was going to go pick up her children on Saturday. And that's the last anybody actually saw her. Jessica Bobiga is Janine's best friend, who got strange text messages from someone claiming to be Janine the day after she disappeared. She wrote she was calling the cops. I don't want that, came the reply. I have the kids. I apologize. I have to do this for the children. She didn't see the children this weekend, so I don't know who that was and what they were covering for. She's my oldest friend. Like, my mother is distraught. Something happened. Something bad happened. And I don't know what it is. And I really hope I'm wrong. Now, friends say Camerata's estranged husband does have their kids and they are safe. We were not able to reach him tonight. Her boyfriend, who reported her missing, was questioned tonight by police, but they have not said if they, are to, if they believe there was any criminal activity involved in this case. They have said, though, they want help from the public. If you know anything about what happened to Janine, police hope you'll call.